Hello, my name is Leon and I'm sailing the Halva Krasi 46 Regin Alaska with a lot of ocean sail training. And today I want to show you how I do a typical planning with uh, by using Time Zero software. So when I'm navigating, I like using the vector charts, like here when we you can see that we've just entered and anchored in Cascais on the west coast of Portugal. When I do the planning, however, I do really like the raster charts. And before I do any planning, I have to do some definitions up under options and routes, because here I can decide whether the program should prevent creating a route when the leg is considered unsafe. All right, that's very helpful. So what's unsafe? If you click on route safety configuration, there's a lot that you can uh, put here. For instance, safety depth, five meters in my case, my safety height, my air draft is 22 meters, and a lot of things I want to avoid. You do this only once, really. So when you've done that, you can create a route. Let's see if we want to go tomorrow down to Cenis. So I can zoom in very easily and start a route outside the marina, let's say here, new route, and then I can easily zoom out, place a waypoint, and if it tries to play, place a waypoint over here, it doesn't work. As you can see, I click and it doesn't place a waypoint there because it's a firing range. So I have to go out a little bit and then I can go down, zoom out again, go around the corner, place a waypoint here, zoom in again and the final waypoint here and I end the route. I can give it a name. In this case, I just leave it uh, by the default. I finish it and here we are. When this now is clicked in, I have a lot of information down here on the lower part of the screen and I can decide, for instance, that I wish to depart tomorrow, which is the 2nd um, of August at, let's say, uh, 10 o'clock UTC. On my boat everything is UTC to make things simple when I am changing the time zone. So what, I what you can see here now that with a uh, speed through water of six knots approximately, I would arrive, it, the whole trip is 52 miles, and I would arrive at 18.45 in the evening. Okay, let's say that I assume the wind is a bit uh, better, so I can sail a bit faster, I can click on action, and set the speed of all legs to, for instance, seven knots, and it changes here, and it says I have a speed of a ground of seven knots, and I arrive already at 17.30, half past five. Okay, that's easy. So using the um, route software is really practical to quickly determine where you want to go and to avoid any dangers. So that's what I use for coastal sailing. Really interesting, it becomes when we go offshore in my next video.